There's not a world that these two people don't belong together. Beth and Colin truly are just perfect for each other. God brought them together at a time when they needed each other, and they have been inseparable ever since. This beautiful bride I've ever seen. That's allowed, but yes. So beautiful. <laughs> so do you. When you feel lost and running low, sink into my love just like a stone. No matter the miles from you, I know wherever you are, I call about a foundation we tend to think that we've kind of made ourselves the person that we are but the truth is that you've had a strong foundation in your families people you have surrounded with your friends it really helped you to become the persons that you are today the persons that you have chosen to to love and to cherish for the rest of your life I love you, love you. Love you, Gunka. Love you too. Love you, Grandma. Love you too. Me and Papa take care of him. I will, I will. Get those tissues ready. Love you. Love you. We have God with us, the source of our love, the source of your love, the source of your life. Because of that, all things are possible. We celebrate the love that you have for each other. We now very joyfully come together and witness those wedding vows. I, Colin, take you, Bethany, to be my wife. I, Bethany, take you, Colin, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. Oh, 
I'll present to you Mr. and Mrs. Colin and Bethany Scott. just that God would continue to bless them and that they would be open to his blessing in their life because I think he's going to bless them greatly. Yes. Yeah. Beth's nephew, Miles, calls them Beth Cowan. <laughs> and he has it right. The two were joined together as one today. But honestly, they've been one since they first met. A long life, health, and happiness to Beth and Colin. Yes. Yeah. Sure. COVID was their courtship, and no mask could disguise the smile on her face or the love in his eyes. May you laugh and love always, ever looking for fun. Let's raise a toast to these two and celebrate, for the night is still young. You all have raised two of the most incredible people that I have had the privilege of calling my friends. If Colin turns out to be half as good of a husband and father as he has been a friend to me, then you have an absolutely wonderful life ahead of you. To Colin and Beth. Let's have a great night. Let's have a night to remember or not remember however you want to do it. So, cheers. Cheers.